Hi. Dobry wieczór. Hello, my name is Ruby Wax. Привет, меня зовут Руби Вокс. I just like to first of all say what a thrill it is to be here in Odessa, here among all you Odessites or whatever you people call yourself. It's just so interesting to be here in the land where all my relatives left that many moons ago. And because they were in a bit of a rush, has anybody seen a pair of tan shorts? I think my great great uncle Nikolai Vexanovich might have left them here. Tan shorts, size 14. No. Okay, hi. I'm an American. I don't know if you noticed that or not. Yep, I scored another biggie in Odessa. You could hear a pin drop, which is important in comedy, I think. Some people actually had to get up and leave. They found me that funny. And happily, I had five more nights to go. Katorim Nozhny. I don't know why I'm doing this. I don't know why I'm doing it. I completely flopped already, so why am I bothering with this stuff? No, you're not flopped. I flopped. I flopped everywhere we went. You saw me. You were standing no. next to me. You never laughed. Nobody ever laughed. Will you visit me? Come to Russia? Yeah. No. No. I bet we could meet in Sweden. That's halfway. Why not? Why I wouldn't come back? Well, I... See, I wasn't raised for this. I couldn't take it. Does this upset you? Yes, it is. It does upset you? Yeah. See, I like you, and so I don't like that Russians treat other Russians like dirt. And there's a great culture, but you're treated like something on the bottom of a shoe. And you do it to each other. Your people cannot understand this. They had no this terrible experience which Russians had in the 30s and then in 40s and 50s, in Stalin's time. When people are afraid to say a word, because this word can kill all family and all families of relatives and friends. Just one word, you know? And because Stalin was sort of person as Hitler, a lot of people believe him and then, when all your family was killed, then uh, another part of your family during years was in prison, and then they say you, we're sorry, we're sorry. It's a mistake. Your father wasn't an uh, enemy, your father wasn't uh, uh, a spy, but your father is already dead. They killed him. What people feel, you know? And uh, people still afraid during years. And just only now, last years, they allowed to speak about all these things and uh, to say what they think and uh, to explain their anger and their unhappiness and so. But now, when you begin to speak and you begin to really think about it and explain it, Nobody can stop it anymore, and I hope it will change. Really, a lot of things will change. 